This is my grandmother, Arlie Mae. This weekend marks the 80th anniversary of her birth. She was raised during the Great Depression. She saw friends and family lose all hope. She saw the institution of the New Deal. As a young child, she was alive to see the first talkie hit theaters. She was there for the first regular TV broadcast in the United States. She saw color TV be introduced and change America's way of life forever. She saw the introduction of the polio vaccine. She was alive for the invention of man-made insulin. She saw the introduction of the combined oral contraception pill. In later years, she was around for the introduction of the first self-contained artificial heart. In her lifetime, she has seen the invention of the electric dry shaver, aerosol spray, sliced bread, the band-aid, nylon, microwave ovens, nuclear reactor, the atomic bomb, Velcro, fiber optics, cochlear implants, laser, the microprocessor, compact discs, LCD displays, VHS tapes, Apple computer, that was a mouthful. As a child, she heard the buzz about Amelia Earhart's disappearance. She was alive to witness the first successful helicopter flight over U.S. soil. She saw the first astronaut land on the moon. She saw the space shuttle Challenger explode. She's lived through U.S. involvement in numerous wars. World War II, the Korean War, the Vietnam War, the Bay of Pigs, Grenada, U.S. invasion of Panama, the Persian Gulf War, U.S. intervention in Bosnia, the invasion of Afghanistan, the invasion of Iraq. I'm sure there'll be more. She birthed and raised five children and saw the births of many grand and great-grandchildren. Arlie Mae worked most of her life nursing the sick and met every new challenge throughout decades of health care. Arlie Mae has seen more than I can imagine in 80 years of life. She's a walking history of the Midwest and our nation. She's my grandmother. So happy birthday, Grandma Arlie.